Hi guys, welcome to GiantVeggies.com, home of the Monster Garden Sauce, uh, which is the rich compost tea. That, uh, we've been feeding our plants um, once a week, and uh, today I wanted to show you how to grow giant uh, cucumbers. Uh, if you're in the market or would like to try and grow cucumbers for competition, uh, they're really not for eating. Um, but the, you know, the bigger they get, the tougher they get. But if, if you're wanting to grow, uh, grow a giant one, I'm going to show you how to do that today. You probably have already seen or may have seen part one of the giant cucumber in Texas. Uh, we recently put up this trellis. Uh, you want your vines growing up a trellis. I will add another one to this probably next week. Um, the, uh, the blooms are, are pretty healthy uh, on, the, on these two plants. This is actually two plants right here. And if you saw part one of this video, uh, how I self-pollinated That was last week, and what I what I want to show you today is uh, if you want a, a giant cucumber, how to do that. Uh, so that said, what I'll do. Okay, um, let's find some more. There's several on here. Here's one right here. This one is about a, a, a week old. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and take that one off. Here's one right here that's growing in. And the reason why I'm cutting these off is because that one's about three days old. Um, so what I'll do is I'll go through this plant and cut off all these small ones like this because I've had my eye on a couple on this particular plant that uh, has really been producing quite well and if you if you zoom in down here you can see the difference between these cucumbers Th this cucumber is the same it came up the same day this one did. This one was about uh, six days old. It's about right now. It's about uh, a little over seven inches long. It just lost its flower today, so now you should see a rapid, rapid growth in the cucumber. Once once it once the flower drops off, that's when it really starts expanding. And we've been feeding this plant with the Monster Garden sauce to to hopefully show the results. Uh, if I can get this particular cucumber to grow for another uh, 20 days, more than likely I'm probably going to have uh, a winner uh, for competition. That said, uh, the reason why I take all these off, I don't want them to get any bigger. If I let this uh, grow to 10 inches, it's going to take up a lot of nutrients from this plant and instead of having all the, that energy and power and nutrients going to these other cucumbers, I wanted to all focus on this one. So this one will get all the nutrients to where it has its full capacity uh, and, and max out with all the nutrients. Uh, there was another one that was growing pretty good. Um, on this plant, I'm going to go ahead and remove this one too. This one is about uh, six days old as well. And it's a pretty good, pretty good contender. But it's on the same plant, and I don't want the nutrients going to something like this that's going to take away from this one. And as you can, uh, you can see why I'm eliminating uh, this one. So. Uh, if you want to grow a giant, get rid of all of the small ones. 
keep your eye on a a real fast growing cucumber that gets real that gets real big in just a few days like that that's going to be your your contender that you compete with uh, I will tell you that uh, cucumbers grow extremely fast especially when you're using the monster garden sauce uh, so you need to keep your eye on it every two days uh, come out here and start and clip off all of your other small cucumbers that are popping up because they they pop up every two days um, we will continue to video this particular plant next week and we'll measure it and we'll see uh, what it looks like next Sunday today Sunday seven days from now we'll we'll video it again and see what it did in seven days thank you